Hi everyone, welcome back to a new tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show you how to motion tracking in After Effects. Using this method, you can track a text or even your logo into video. So let's get started. Okay, I'm uh, drag and drop this video into a new composition. I have this video, as you can see. Now let's select this video and go to Windows and go to Tracker. And here I will uh, use this track motion option. Let's select this. This will uh, give us the tracking point. So let's select a good position for the tracker. Here I will use this tire. Make sure it's a little bit small because if this is larger, it will take a lot of time to calculate. This should work. After you uh, set the tracking point, you can Select this uh, analyze forward option. It will analyze. Now you should have a uh, tracking data like this, as you can see. Now we need to uh, apply this into a, a null layer. So let's create a new null layer. And I'm gonna uh, rename this as uh, tracking data. Now click this edit target option. It will give a motion target. And here select your null layer. Now click OK. Now select this apply button here you can give your uh, axis in this case i want both x and y axis if you want only one you can choose here so let's hit ok as you can see now our null layer have uh, all the tracking data now let's type a text i'm gonna type something let's give this text to uh, expression uh, basically speed expression so let's select this tracking data option and press v it will bring position and i will select the uh, text layer go to text and here we have a source text and i'm gonna link this to a position now if you uh, select the uh, text and press double e on your keyboard it will give us the expression here i will remove the zero and I will type this expression. I will put this expression in the link in the description. Okay. As you can see, now we have this expression. Basically, this will give us the uh, speed of the motion. Now we can uh, link this to our tracking data. So let's parent this and now press S. It will bring scale properties and I will place this to something here. Now as you can see our uh, track is nicely working. You can also add a drop shadow and then increase the softness. That's basically it for this tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed this and also thank you so much for the Patreon supporters. I wish you guys in the next one. Have a great day.